Hi guys, welcome to Code Bashers. So guys, as you all know that Tech Mahindra interviews for AST role are starting from next week. Okay, so many of you on Telegram was asking me that sir, how to prepare for the interviews. So for that purpose only, I have decided to make a technical interview experience that happened recently only so that you can get to know that what are the different types of questions that are getting asked in the interviews. Okay, and you can prepare for the topics that are very important for the interviews okay so guys now let's start this video before starting this video make sure to hit that like and subscribe button for this channel because for every company if you will go on our channel whether it is Infosys, Tech Mahindra or TCS we are making preparation videos for their exams and for the interviews also so make sure to hit that like and subscribe button and make sure to join this telegram group it is a dedicated telegram group for 2025 batch students okay so here we are discussing about all the companies which are hiring the link of this telegram group you will find in the description box make sure to join it okay so guys now let's start this video okay so guys in this particular uh, interview lot of coding questions were asked okay they were simple but like uh, quantity was great so first was write a code to find the palindrome of a string and second was swap three numbers without using the third variable swap two numbers without using the third variable okay so first code is this that how to find whether a string is palindrome or not we have to just iterate over the string from one pointer to the end one pointer to the start and we'll compare each and every uh, character next question was how to swap two numbers without using the third variable so with using the third variable it's very easy but without using it's like this so you can have a screenshot of this question also and you can understand it by yourself it's very easy okay so i hope this question is clear to you i just by this i wanted to tell you that coding question will also be asked in the interviews okay next question was why you made project on android and what was your role in the project so guys as you are giving the interviews for the it role in tech mahindra so lot of focus will be on your resume in resume what is the most important component it is your projects so try to mention at least two projects in your resume and if you have mentioned two projects make sure that you you can explain each and everything about that particular project okay so each uh, for every project you should know that why you have made it what's your long term goal for this project what's a unique thing that you're doing in this project what are the challenges you faced in this project okay how you overcome those challenges and what your what was your idea for making that project so all these questions related to your projects can be asked from you make sure that you are preparing for them well okay so why you made projects based on android so you can answer it by yourself next question is introduce yourself so generally the first question is introduction but here the third or fourth question was introduction no issues you can include your college you can add educational background your skills your extracurricular activities all these things like projects internships all these things you can uh, include in this particular question and the interview will be happy to uh, listen okay next is again a coding part coding pattern 112358 so this is a fibonacci series so you should know that how to code fibonacci series again it's a very basic question see four to five coding questions have been discussed here all are very basics not just tech mahindra but other companies also do ask these basic questions okay so you can you can see this code i have given this uh, screenshot here you can take the screenshot for this code okay okay so guys lot of you were asking me that sir from where we should prepare for the interview uh, okay tech mahindra interview so on our top on our top mid page of code bashers we have important interview it subject notes you can see here so in these interview uh, it subject notes we have total 12 subjects covered c plus plus java python dbms sql coding questions okay commonly asked in interviews operating system networking questions machine learning cloud computing hr and manual questions also so all these important interview questions for each and every subject we have covered in these notes every subject once you will get these notes for every subject there is a dedicated pdf like this you can see here and in every pdf you will find at least 20 to 25 important questions as well as their answers which are very commonly asked in the interviews if i will show you a sample of let's suppose java pdf okay so once you will get this note and open the java pdf you will see that there is a proper question given there is a proper answer given and in some cases we have given proper code part also so that your concepts are really clear okay so for every subject you uh, dedicated pdf is there and in that pdf you will be getting around 20 to 25 
commonly asked interview questions and answers okay sql queries and coding questions also are present there okay so if you think that this will be beneficial for you for your preparation then you can check out these notes in the description box it is at a very nominal price of rupees 109 and the excess of this is for the lifetime till now total 1729 people have bought it and we have a good rating of 4.2 out of 5 so do check them out and they can help you in your preparation for the interviews not only for tech mahindra but for different companies also all the relevant links you will find in the description box now let's continue the video next is next question is are you comfortable with the new technologies according to the requirement because see what will happen let's suppose now you know android but once you get selected in tech mahindra they have the requirement for spring boot so are you comfortable in changing the technologies so here your answer should be always yes because see you are a fresher you should need to learn new things so your answer should be has yes that you are uh, open to learn all those things okay next is explain oops concepts so there are four major oops concepts abstraction encapsulation inheritance and polymorphism so in any interview oops concepts question will be asked from you okay in 10 out of 10 interviews you will find this oops uh, concept questions okay so uh, how to explain each and every concept in detail i will give you the link of that video i have made a dedicated video on it okay so link you will find in the i button or in the description box okay so if you are finding this video informative till here make sure to hit that like and subscribe button and make sure to join this telegram group it is dedicated for 2025 plus students okay so yeah moving ahead is expert is a static variable so static variable is a class level variable that is shared among all instances of the class so it is not a class local variable it's a static variable next is it is declared using the static keyword memory is allocated only once because it's common for all the objects shared by all the objects of the class and can be accessed using the class name so this is the definition of static variable okay next is write a query for descending order write a query for descending uh, for finding the rows in descending order so it's very simple select column 1 comma column 2 from table name order by column name descending so this is the simple one okay moving towards the next question is what are the different types of inheritance in uh, the language okay so since i have told you oops concepts are very much uh, useful so inheritance is also one of the things so what is inheritance when a parent class when a child class inherits some of the property from the parent class next thing is types of inheritance so types will be what are the different types it can be single inheritance multi level inheritance multiple inheritance and hierarchical inheritance okay so this is also possible next is question is what are different types of constructor so again default constructor parameterized constructor copy constructor for each of the constructor you will have to explain it in detail okay yeah next question is again a program to reverse a string so again very simple you can just check it out the code you can take the screenshot for it so you can see in this particular interview experience lot of coding questions have been asked next is in c++ he asked to share screen and write syntaxes of string compare and syntaxes of polymorphism type so oops concepts i have told you in dedicated video i have made it so there i have done the coding part also so you can check out that video for how to write polymorphisms as a code okay next question is uh, anything from me like any question you want to ask from the interviewer and then moving ahead where do you watch yourself in next 5 years some hr questions uh is growing uh, of technology good for humans just a general based question and would you prefer hard work or smart work so always smart work next is who is your, who is your inspiration inspiration so any like anything you want to say you can tell here okay and next is what made you choose as the it sector so these were all the hr questions in the last five okay so i have discussed in this particular video all the technical questions which are asked with their answers all the hr questions if you still have any doubts and you want me to cover more such interview experiences do write in the comment section that you want more such videos and do write in the comment section that uh, why <coughs> uh, that when is your actual interview okay so that i can like prepare for that thing okay so i hope now all these things are clear to you make sure to hit that like and subscribe button if you have found this video informative till here make sure to join this telegram group all the links you'll find in the description box thank you for watching this video